Hi, I'm Service Manager of Pottery's MoneyWise under Citizens Advice Bureau. We're looking for this funding to start a new innovation project which is empowers people's financial capability. Our previous work has highlighted that clients come to us continuously for fuel vouchers to help them pay their energy bills. This funding is going to enable us to do a more of a wraparound service looking at their budgeting and other incomes and outgoings. We hope to minimise their outgoings and maximise maxim, maximize their incomings. Hopefully, to, in future, for them not to rely on these fuel vouchers to pay their energy bills so they can contribute to their, themselves through money that we've saved through other bills and utility bills. We hope you enjoy this video and I hope you have an insight of what we can do and how we work and we look forward to starting this project with you. Morning Mrs Singh, how are you? Yes. Yes, yeah, I'm, I'm very well thank you, thank you. Um, I'd just like to go over a few things if that's okay with you. Um, we've had a few sort of updates and things over the next coming months that I'd like to talk to you about. Okay? Yeah, that's fine. Thank you. Uh, okay, so according to the latest predictions, the energy price cap is set to increase in October by a further 51% for someone on typical use. In addition to this, interest rates are predicted to continually rise over the next few months, which could lead to further price increases of everyday goods and services. Do you understand that so far, Mr. Singh? Yeah, yeah, okay, brilliant, brilliant. Okay. Therefore, it is important that we discuss the wraparound service we offer to ensure that you can mitigate the rising costs. For example, advising you on the emergency costs of living support announced by the government, such as the council tax energy rebate, energy bills discount, one-off costs of living payments for those on a low income, those that have a disability and are of pensionable age. I'll send out leaflets as well to you know, that summarises all of this information for you. Completing a benefit entitlement check to see if you are receiving all that you're entitled to. Ensuring that your energy bill is accurate and the amount you're paying is in accordance with your usage. Maximising your income in other areas such as using shopping loyalty cards and applying for help with health costs. And reducing your expenditure by accessing social tariffs for your water and broadband. Is that okay so far, Mrs. Singh? Okay, fantastic. But yes, I, I understand. It's a, it, it's a lot to take in, isn't it? But yeah. <laughs> so I do, we do understand that this is a challenging time for you and your family. However, if you work with us, then you will be hopefully be able to feel more financially capable and confident. So please, if you have any further queries on what we talked about this morning, then please call us on 01782 408685 and we look forward to hearing from you. Okay, have a lovely day now. Take care. Bye bye. Bye bye. Hi, we're here today outside Eaton Park Post Office and uh, this is Amanda from Pottery's Money Wise and this is Sophie from British Gas. Hi, I'm Sophie from British Gas. We're here today to support the Stop the Silence campaign with partnership with British Gas Energy and the post office. Amanda, why do we need the extra funding? Well, due to the next crisis of increases in October, we're worried that clients are not going to be able to afford their bills and the extra funding will allow us to be able to support and get more clients to offer that support they may need. Can you give me an example of where the continued funding of from the British Gas Energy Trust has impacted a client? So I've been working with a client for over a year now. She was a domestic victim and she came to the service. She was unable to even speak because she was that scared. Um, with the continuous support and the funding from British Gas, we were allowed to be able to work with her for a long period of time and get lots of access and support for her. We managed to get her a British Gas Energy Trust write-off so her debt was gone. We also supported with a big difference scheme. We also completed a limited capability for work through university credit to get to that extra work and no demands on getting a job. 
because she was classed as long term disabled and we also managed to secure personal independence payment for her and all in all the gains for that was about £10,000. The client has now been able to look forward to a better future more and more control of the bills and that was thanks to the extra funding to allow me to continue to reach them people who need us the most. Oh thanks Amanda that's brilliant. Right I'll leave you to it then girls handing out those freebies and um, offering on the spot advice to anyone that comes past. Thank you. Thank you.